example of a disposable mask, an FFP3 often used on construction sites. I'm going to show you briefly how this is worn. The key with a face fit test are a few things. Firstly, clean shaven, otherwise the mask will not create a proper seal. Secondly, before the test we advise not to have any drink other than water, so no caffeine, no sweet sugary drinks, and also smoking, so you can avoid smoking before a test because that obviously would inhibit the test. Next thing really important is to make sure that the person having the test is not diabetic because one of the solutions is sugar based. The next question to ask your participant for the face fit test is are you allergic to anything? I'm not allergic to anything no. Brilliant. Sometimes the ingredients on the solutions may affect the person so it's really important that we always find out if they're allergic to anything. So now we're going to carry on with the face fit test. We're only going to do a little bit because obviously you would benefit from a face to face fit test yourself. This is just to give you an example. So Tom, are you claustrophobic? No, I'm not claustrophobic. Okay, I'm going to place this hood over your head, okay? And I'm just going to gently ease it forward so there's a gap between the front of the hood and your face. The next stage in the face fit test is to perform a sensitivity test. We generally have two solutions that we can use. Which one we use depends on the answers given from the participant, Tom, um, regarding on the allergen. So he has no allergies, so I've already decided which one to use for him. So if you could hold those, Tom. Preloaded this already into our pump. I'm now going to put this pump through to the hood. So Tom, I'm going to bring this, I'm going to pop it through the hood. And what we're going to do is I'm going to pump it and you're going to let me know when you can taste the solution. Okay. So if you could open your mouth, place your tongue very slightly out, and then let me know when you start to taste this, okay? Yep, I can taste it. Okay, wonderful. So that's seven pumps. So I can remove the hood now, Tom. So the next stage would be to repeat the test with Tom wearing the face mask. But really, this needs to be done face to face with your safety advisor. So for the purposes of training, we're going to stop here.